Hi everyone, in this lesson, we'll be creating the back site. First, I'm going to go to our buddies and turn on the visibility of our slider. I'm going to go to right view. I'm going to zoom in. I'm going to hit L to grab our line and select our plane. I'm going to zoom in on this portion. Going to drop our first point here, second point here, third point, fourth point. Hitting escape, hitting L once more to grab our line. I'm going to drop our first point at the midpoint of this horizontal line. Left click, moving up, hitting escape, reselecting this vertical line and hitting X to make this one as a construction line. Next, I'm going to go to constraints, scroll down and select symmetry, selecting this point, this point and our symmetry line, hitting D. To grab our dimension, selecting this line and this horizontal line, I'm going to drop our dimension here. I'm going to key in 60, hitting enter. Dimension tool still active. I'm going to select this edge and this horizontal line. I'm going to drop our dimension here. I'm going to key in 1.8, hitting enter. Next, selecting this point and this point. Dropping our dimension here, keying in 4, hitting enter. Next, selecting this edge and our midpoint. Dropping our dimension here, keying in 12, hitting enter. Hitting escape, arranging our dimension. So left click and hold to move this one here. Inspecting if it's fully constrained. So now I'm going to hit E for extrude. I'm going to create a window selection to select the profile. I'm going to drag our arrow. Operation to be cut. Direction to be symmetric. Distance to be all. And finally hit OK. Let's now round our sharp edges. I'm going to hit F to grab our fillet, selecting this edge, this edge, this edge. Control left click, control left click. And finally, this one. For the radial value, I'm going to key in point 0.1 and hit OK. Going back to right view, I'm going to hit L for line and select this plane. Next, let's turn on the visibility of our previous sketch. I'm going to expand sketches folder. I'm going to scroll down and turn on sketch 75. Zooming in, left click here. Left click, left click, and final point here. Hitting escape, selecting this line, right click, selecting horizontal vertical. So this one, take note, should be parallel or collinear with this line. So if not, you may add parallel or collinear. Next, I'm going to hit D, selecting this edge. And this edge, dropping our dimension here, keying in 5, hitting enter, hitting escape, inspecting our entities. So now I'm going to hit E for extrude, selecting this profile, and this profile, so 2 selected. Operation to be new body, direction to be symmetric. For the distance, 
I'm going to type 11. And finally, hit OK.